Hello everyone, and welcome back to another Minecraft New 3DS Let's Play video. I, I'm not sure what part this is, I'm losing track of all my video parts now, but... Yeah, in the last video, we um, discovered or explored the desert temple that was over there. And in this video, we are going to be doing some updates to my house, because it is starting to look a little bit, you know... Not good because the wood doesn't go around all around the house and stuff. So we are going to get all the wood I have left in here. And we are going to get started. And I'm going to get rid of some of my items because we don't want all this junk in our inventory. And that's, I think that's all I need to remove. Just that one thing. But I think that'll do me good. So I'm going to collect more uh, wood now. And wow, I'm already noticing better frame rates. I mean, look at this. I mean, I'm going outside looking at the uh, mountains and stuff, and I'm getting 50 to 60 FPS, which is great. And you guys can actually tell us in the video because the video is 60 FPS. So it's really good that Mojang and Other Ocean are finally starting to improve Minecraft 3DS performance, which I think is really great for gameplay. And I think they finally. I think the consistent frame rate thing now is kind of like, well, I really don't think it needs to happen now because it's just the frame rates are now really good. So I'm going to get this tree right here because it's right next to me. And obviously you guys know I do have an upload schedule. And the, uh, the thing, the upload schedule, basically how it's going to work is I know I haven't uploaded a video in a couple of days. And either it's because I've had you know, other things going on, or I've just, you know, didn't have enough time to make a video. So, sometimes if you haven't seen a video for a couple of days, that's probably the reason why. And also, unfortunately, my HPMV is having another, is having a problem. Yes, you heard that right. Um, I'm either going to have to replace it for another laptop or send it in to get it repaired. And basically what's the problem is, is that the fan... Whenever I turn on the laptop, it makes a really bad grinding noise. And at this point of the video, I will have a clip of that right now. Yeah, you guys probably heard that the laptop fan does not sound very good at all. So, unfortunately, I mean, once the laptop completely, like, boots and everything, the fan doesn't make that noise anymore. And even when the fan goes to really high speeds, it, um, doesn't do that. It only does it when it starts up, so it's kind of really weird. So, I'm not sure, you're really sure what's the problem, but I'm going to try to blow some compressed air inside of a vent to see if there's any dust. But if dust isn't the case, then it's definitely the fan. But I haven't tried blowing out dust yet, so I will try that when the video's over, but yeah, it's pretty bad. But, but luckily, if I do have to replace my laptop or if I have to send it in for repair for like a week, I will still post videos because I can just edit them on my um, tablet instead. I just got to transfer my intro and outro to it, and there you go. I can make videos and I can edit the videos on my tablet. They won't look as, they probably won't look as good. They, it probably won't be 60 frames per second because iMovie on my iPad has very inconsistent um, frame rates for transferring. I'm not sure how to change it, but yeah. So some videos, they're all gonna be 1080p for sure, but they're just not gonna be. Some will be 60 FPS, some won't. But that's if I have to send my laptop in for warranty, which most likely probably won't happen. But I kind of hope it does, because I really do like my HP Envy. So I'm in here because it's nighttime, but I also want to grab a couple more axes. So I have extra ones, and then I'll, and then I'll go to bed. So you have 44 pieces of um, oak wood, which is really good. And I'm probably going to spawn. Oh, I didn't spawn outside my house that time. I guess they fixed that glitch. So, wow, my sensitivity for my C-Stick is not very high. Controls, sensitivity, turn that up more. Because my C the C-Stick on the 3DS sucks. 
it's not very responsive and that's because of the very small design. Since I have a pretty large thumb, I mean my thumb, you can probably fit at least seven or eight of C-sticks in my thumb. So to my thumb, the C-stick is pretty small. And I literally have to use my nail to get a good grip on it. Like, it's really that bad. Now the sensitivity is a lot better, which is much better because I, cause I barely have to press the C-stick and it actually moves enough to where I want it to move. And yet still, it's just not responding. Wow. I've seen people put, I've seen people do mods of their C-sticks by placing, I believe, PS Vita C-stick covers on them, which I personally won't do because I don't have a PS Vita and I'm not buying one for that single part. So maybe I'll just find a kit on Amazon that'll allow me to modify my C-stick so I can have a more grippier one because I don't know why Nintendo put the soft junk one on there. Sucks. So what about this section right here? What am I going to do about that? Um... I'm just going to destroy this a little column here. See what happens. And see what I can do about this little inlet here. I mean, it gives my house some character. I was going to say, oh, let's fill it in, but then it actually gives my house some character and nice look. So I don't think I'm actually going to do that. But I will continue, oops. I will continue the wood accenting around this area. But I think what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to kind of bring it over. I'm going to put it inside like this. And then I'm just going to keep going. So I'm going to kind of bring this over too. I'm going to go like that. I think that looks pretty good. So the next thing we're going to do, since the wood accenting is all done, is I'm going to... Let's close on my uh, porch, my upper porch. I'm not sure what to close in with. I could close in with some glass. Oops. Let's see if I have any glass on me. No, don't have any there. I'm trying to look at all my chests. This is my miscellaneous chests. Probably might be some in here. No. I don't even any in there. Oh, there's our two diamonds still in there. Luckily. And there's a piece of wool in there. So, let's see if any of this is in my upstairs chest. Oh, perfect, 34. That's great. Now let's go up here, and it's right here, so I can easily just place all the glass I need. Give it a nice skylight kind of appearance. I believe my room has a skylight on it. hope it does. If it doesn't, I'll make one. Yeah, it does. <laughs> so... Um, yeah, I think that's pretty much all the updates I'm going to do in my house. Actually, I'm going to do some glass up here as well for the porch areas. Anything that has a porch, I'm going to do a glass. I think it just gives it a great look, and it just protects it from rain. Not that really matters, but, you know, who wants rain in your face? Ooh, and I just ran out. Uh-oh. I have to go get some more sand off camera, but that's okay. At least I got this much done already. All right, so I think my house is looking pretty good. I've already fixed the path from that creeper, and I think I'm going to place a crafting table out here because I need that extra craftability in this area. So I need to grab, or there we go. Alright, so let's place this crafting table right here. Actually, I thought I had one up there. No, I don't. So... Ladders, ladders. Wish there was a search function. Well, then you have to be like bing, 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 bing for every key, which would be kind of annoying. But it would be nice if they implement, implemented that feature. But of course we know Mojang's never going to do that. Because they... Actually, this version of Minecraft is actually pretty regularly updated. So who knows? Why won't it let me... Oh, do I need to make more of the... Uh... Alright, there we go. Now I made some ladders, which we need three, which is perfect. So that's how much I made. This also got damaged from the creeper explosion as well, which I have not fixed for a long time, I believe since episode 7, so like 10 episodes ago. So, oh look, there's a crafting table right there too. So, yeah, look at that. My treehouse is still looking good. No missing leaves. Probably because I've placed enough blocks to where it just doesn't do it anymore. And let's check out this area. Looking good. This is the bathroom, I think. So... Let's go upstairs to the second floor. 
Here's the second floor with the, um, this is supposed to be my bedroom. There's a porch. I can actually jump over to my roof if I ever need to. That's convenient. And then if we go up to the third floor, which is technically the, um, this floor, which is the roof, technically. Why do I have a random piece of birch up here? I guess it gives it an accent. Like a interesting look. All right. Let's jump over to my roof down here. And I'm hurting myself. So, yeah, that's probably going to conclude it for this video. I said I was going to do house updates, and there you guys go. House updates. So, in the next video, obviously, all the glass will be done. And I'll most... And I... Oh, my gosh. Before I end this video, I have to do that um, trap door. I just have to. I cannot leave it like that. Let's see. Mechanisms. They call it mechanisms and not redstone. Maybe because they include the tripwire. Actually, that is all redstone. Well, there is beacon, too, which is not redstone. Let's see if we can find trapdoors. There they are. So we need... We need more wood planks. We need wood planks for everything, of course. Let's make some more. Like, enough to where we can actually have a lot. So there you go. Makes two trapdoors per thing. And there we go. Final trapdoor. Now I don't have to look at that anymore and say, Oh, one missing trapdoor. I now have a completed um, flower box garden without the flowers in it, of course. And yeah, and I want to place a couple more flowers over there. So yeah, that's going to conclude it for this video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.